Hello everyone, I thought it was about time that I did a little unboxing of this year's festive one. This year we decided to ship out the festive one in a festive box that you can reuse um, to stash away all of your festive planning goodies. There were three options when you purchased the festive one. You could have the stationery bundle, the binder bundle or the combo bundle and the combo bundle had everything in it. Also, if you purchased a combo bundle, you get a little extra gift which is what's in here. I'm not going to show you that because I'm going to leave it as a surprise for those people that do opt for the combo bundle. So inside the box, we've got our postcard, which has got um, the Holly Jolly Christmas motif on it. It also has the link to the digital bundle that you can download for free um, and some other information that you get alongside any of our festive one purchases. You've also got a little sticker, a little vinyl sticker, which says it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Super cute. Um, the festive one stationery bundle. So inside this, we have stencil stickers and washi tape. Let's pull them all out and have a little closer looky. So the stickers, it's an A5 sheet, the hole punch that you can store them in a A5 file effects or a binder. Um, and it's all all of the festive one this year is in the, the same colour palette so it's navy blue, red and white with a little bit of a, a green accent um, lots of cute stickers for decorating your Christmas spreads and let me just grab whoop, this to show you my stencils so the first stencil included is the classic festive one stencil so we've got a tag um, thought you could use those for weekly spreads or for gift lists. A little border which has got our candy canes in it um, and a bow maker so you can pop that on top of boxes and things to make it festive. Lots of different ways that you can use it. We wanted something that was Christmas but also that you could reuse certain elements for different spreads all year round so that it's not just a Christmas based stencil. We've also got a new font for you this font is called gingerbread so this is the gingerbread uppercase and it's also the font that we've used in our stickers so a little bit of continuity there and lowercase version there um, and then we've got a super easy stencil and it's a gift tag super easy month um, so if you lay it across two pages, you've got a monthly spread where a gift tag is each day. These little holes are the holes for the gift tag. So what you would do is trace out all the tags and then move the stencil over slightly. So this hole lays over the top of the tag um, to give it like a gift tag look. Um, you could also use it for kind of bucket list type things. So maybe each tag is a Christmas movie that you want to watch. Um, countdown spreads, lots of different ways that you can use that. And then also in the stationery bundle is our washi tape and it's candy canes. How cute is that? Navy with red and white candy canes um, to go with everything else. It all coordinates. So that's our stationery bundle. And then the other option for the festive one is our binder bundle. I'm just going to move this out of the way so we can have a little looky. Put that down there. So the binder oop, it is a special edition version of our hybrid planner binder. So it is a clear binder. I don't know if you can tell the lights reflecting off of it, but it's glittery and it's got the festive one logo. Um, inside the binder, we have a dashboard, which has got a pocket on the back of it, so you can use it to store things. Oop, like this. Um, and then we have a full set of Christmas planning inserts. Um, you've got three sections, so festive plans, and that's got your monthly calendars for November and December. We have oh, section two, which is getting organized. And in there we've got gift planners, we've got shopping lists, we've got card trackers, oh, flicking through multiple pages, um, lots of card trackers, to-do list, 
Uh, what else have we got? And then section three is our festive fun. So we've got a movies list. There's some movies you want to watch. A playlist of your favourite Christmas songs. Um, your traditions. Um, memories. So journal or doodle your Christmas memories for this year. And next year, things to remember. So things that you did this year that you don't want to do next year or things that you didn't do this year that you want to do next year. And you've then got a big wadge of dot grid paper. It's a five millimetre dot grid. Hopefully you can see that um, with our centre marks and side centre marks. So you can create your own pages within the planner. Um, you have then got a set of dividers. So you can split up those pages and keep it organised for you. Um, so that you can refer back to this year after year. So maybe you put your card list in, your present list, those kind of things. So this is the, the festive one. We really hope you like it. We've worked really hard with this this year. Um, and I absolutely love what we have created. I also thought it would be helpful for me to show you a quick video on how I set up my festive planner. So once I've received it all, um, I'm going to open it up. And I'm going to pop the things into different categories. So, as we've said, this front pocket, there is a little pocket in the front there. I'm going to add in my little sticker and my postcard so I've got it handy. I am going to open up the rings and I'm going to split these pages out into the different dividers. So, taking everything out. Ooh. My first section is my cover page actually I'm going to pop that in here and then section one is section one of the printed items so that is my calendar for the two months November and December then we're going to section two and these are my getting organized pages. So I'll go to those. So they are gift planner, shopping list, card tracker. do list pages remember included with the festive one you do get the digital files so if you want to print more of any of these pages you can do and then section three is section three festive fun so um, let's pop those pages in we've got movies to watch playlist traditions memories from 22 and things to remember for next year i'm going to use my fourth section as where i'm going to for the time being pop my plain dot grid pages so that i can add in any other spreads that i want to set up and i'm going to use this section here for my stencils they all do come punched so um apart from that one but our two font stencils and our classic stencil a super easy stencil that is included with the festive one none of our super easy stencils are punched and the reason for that is because the design tends to go right to the edge of the page so i'm going to pop that in the pocket at the front um, and then i'm going to add my stickers in So I should be all ready to go for festive planning for 2022. Now I just need to write my lists and buy my presents.